Hi, this is Galit Gofarb and thank you very much for joining me. Today I'm going to be talking about BDNF, Brain Derived Neurotrophic Factor. BDNF is a neurotrophin, a growth factor that is a protein that plays a vital role in brain health and flexibility of the central nervous system. BDNF acts like a fertilizer for the brain. It helps brain cells grow during early development as well as supporting adult neurogenesis, which is the growth of new brain cells in adulthood. BDNF also maintains brain circuits through neuroplasticity. Lack of this neurotrophin leads to impaired learning, depression, anxiety, as well as many other neurological conditions including epilepsy, Alzheimer's, OCD, obsessive compulsive disorder, and eating disorders. And since 1995, we also know that BDNF is connected to weight loss. A study showed that brain infusion of BDNF induces weight loss in rats through appetite suppression. Another study showed that BDNF could modify circuits important to eating behavior and energy expenditure. Now, in my recent videos, I spoke about BDNF uh, rise in, through intermittent fasting and regular exercise. But fortunately for us, there are also foods that are known to supply nutrients that increase BDNF levels. Increase these foods in your diet and you ensure healthy functioning of your brain for the long term. There are two nutrients especially known to increase BDNF levels, and these nutrients can be found in a number of foods which I'll talk about in a minute. The first nutrient is resveratrol. This is a polyphenol known for properties of anti-aging and widely used in the treatment of neurodegenerative diseases. Studies suggest that resveratrol has neuroprotective effects on the body by supplying higher levels of BDNF. This nutrient may also be taken as a supplement, but people should take care, especially if they're using non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs and blood thinners, because resveratrol supplementation may increase the bleeding when these other drugs are taken together. It is best taken through food sources, which I'll mention in a moment. Now, the other nutrient is omega-3 fatty acids. This is an essential fat, which has many functions throughout our bodies some which include neuroprotective effects on the brain by normalizing as well as increasing BDNF levels and reducing oxidative damage in the brain. Omega-3 fatty acids also increase BDNF synthesis and signaling between the neurons as well as synaptic plasticity. Okay, so let's talk about the foods rich in these BDNF supporting nutrients. The first ones are berries. In all of their varieties, berries are a fabulous way to introduce resveratrol into your diet. It is effortless to start consuming these berries, whether through oatmeal, porridge, or as part of a, of a fruit salad, strawberries, blueberries, mulberries, cranberries, and some other berries you might never have heard of have high uh, resveratrol levels and th this very potent antioxidant is very, very good for the brain function as well as weight loss. The next food is chia seeds. They are popular, very popular superfood, and there are many reasons why. Chia seeds are very, very rich in the essential omega-3 fats, which increase BDNF levels, as well as being an integral part of cell membranes throughout our entire bodies. These tiny seeds also contain other fatty acids, including omega-6 and omega-9 fatty acids, in perfect proportions between them and the omega-3 fats, which is very, very rare in our diet these days. The next foods are grapes. Uh, grapes should be consumed. They are very rich in resveratrol. Other options can consist of red wine and red grape juice, both of which contain high amounts of this critical antioxidant. Although my recommendation is to go for whole black or red grapes uh, instead of drinking the wine or taking them through grape juice, the resveratrol levels are much higher in the natural grapes. But green grapes, although they contain very low levels of resveratrol, they do contain catechins, which are very potent antioxidants and anti-inflammatories. And they have many, many benefits and are crucial for brain health. So if you like green grapes, you can eat them as well. The next food is walnuts, a very healthy snack packed full of omega-3 fatty acids. We commonly consume these nuts together with uh, dried fruits, maybe raisins, or even other nuts. It's a favorite go-to snack when you're on the run, so eat up. Each walnut is a very rich source of the omega-3 fatty acids, as well as having fiber, 
fiber and many other uh, nutrients along which support digestive function and brain health. The next food is dark chocolate. A hundred gram serving of dark chocolate also contains uh, pretty high levels of resveratrol. So this delicious treat is also good for brain health, although it can be addictive for most people. But if you're not one who becomes addicted to cocoa, then you might enjoy adding raw cocoa powder to your oatmeal or to, to, to your uh, snacks and making yourself a cup of hot cocoa with almond milk to get the benefits of resveratrol. The next food is flax seeds, which may be small, but they are large in nutritional value. Not only are they a good source of omega-3 fats, they also are rich in protein, fiber, magnesium, and vitamin B1. Next time you prepare oatmeal, soups, or any hot dishes, or even salads, you can throw a spoonful of the flax seeds for their very much added benefits. The next food is peanuts. The least of the appreciated nuts, and maybe this is because they are not really a nut, they're actually a legume. Peanuts offer us many tremendous benefits when it comes to providing resveratrol. Peanuts, as well as peanut butter, contain high quantities of this antioxidant. And they are also rich in protein, fiber, vitamin E, magnesium, and the B vitamins, B1, B3, and B9 and as well as iron, so very, very healthy food. Just make sure you're eating them from organic sources, and if you choose peanut butter, check the ingredients for added sugars and oils. The next food is curcumin. Turmeric is a root rich in the compound that has almost endless list of health benefits, curcumin. And when BDNF levels are concerned, curcumin has been found to increase these levels very much. Black pepper along with the turmeric help the absorption of curcumin in the body to get its many health benefits. So you can agree with me that these many options are delicious. Adding this kind of variety to your eating plan is vital for brain function and will support you in long-term uh, weight loss as well as being a natural preventative measure for many neurological conditions in the future. So if you want to incorporate BDNF foods in your diet, check up the Gorilla Diet, and I hope you like this video. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, add the bell for notifications. I upload a new video every single week. And if you want more information on health and weight loss, as well as many programs, books on the subject that I've written, please check out my website at www.thegorilladiet.com. Thank you very much.